Chris. Thank you. The steps of rolling the bocce ball are very similar to rolling a bowling ball. It's simply a left step, a right step, a left, and then your follow through. Okay? I'm going to show you from this side now. We step left, right, left, and then we release the ball. Now when we release, just like any ball sport, it's very important to follow through. So when we follow through, we're going to bring our arm up into our opposite shoulder, our left shoulder. I'll show you from this angle now. We're going to bring our arm up into our left shoulder. Like we're grabbing the back of our shoulder. Okay, so I want you guys right now to practice the steps a couple times. Just get used to doing the left, right, left, release. Okay? Go ahead. Good. Okay, again, one more time as a group. Left, right, left, release. Good. Uh, Joe, can you come over here and show what you just did? I think that Joe might be an avid bowler. Because when he steps, can you do steps again? Left, right, left, release. See how he put his right foot out there? If you reach your right foot out, that helps you balance so you're not throwing off balance and you can aim better. Thank you, Joe. Everyone give Joe up. One more thing that Joe did really well was once he, once he reached the floor, if you're going to do a bowling shot, you want to lower your level of gravity so the ball doesn't fight and get off course. You almost want to touch it to the floor. So this time we're going to do our snaps left, right, left, and touch our hand to the floor, up to the shoulder. Okay? We'll do it one more time this way. Left, right, left, hand to the floor, shoulder. Okay. And you guys go ahead. straight down the red line, that's perfect. We don't want to have to curve our shots in. We want to have a nice straight release. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to be the person that's going to approach the ball and do their flip shot and count off by two. Right? One. One. Okay, so I need all ones to approach the wall and do your standard flip. And retrieve and then the third will go out. Okay? Go ahead, ones. Left, right, left, perfect. Good back. You do it again once, one more time. Good. Remember to really, you really want to snap that wrist to get that spin on the ball so when the ball hits the ground, it sticks. It doesn't really do that with this ball. This is just not the standard bocce ball, but with the heavier balls, if you notice when you put the spin on it, the ball will hit the floor and actually just stick to the floor. Okay, now we're going to have our twos go. Left, right, left, release, very good. One more time. Left, right, left, perfect. Okay, now here's what we're going to do. We're going to step back a little bit. For the second one, we're going to practice our bowling technique. We're going to have our ones go first again. We're going to go left, right, left, hand to the floor, and then to our shoulder. Okay? I'm going to show you one more time for the ball that's one Professor Hobby. When I stand up, I square myself up to my target. Left, right, left, floor to shoulder. And again, we want our ball to go straight forward in this. Okay, ones, go ahead. 
Left, right, left. Good. Perfect, Anthony. Great form. Okay, go ahead, Morris. No, it's one more step. Okay, go ahead, twos. Left, right, left. Good. Joe, make sure that you really set your hand to the floor so the ball doesn't bounce. You want to just give you a nice, steady roll. Okay? Once, go ahead again. Left, right, left. Very good. And now our twos go. Left, right, left. Perfect. Okay. Now what I need everyone to do is I need everybody to get a partner. Come down here on this black baseline once you have your partner. If uh, we're gonna have to have one group of three.